So I've got my car here in Unity from the standard assets. I've made it red. Um, it's very much the same as usual kind of car. I've got a camera, I've got a smooth follow script on it which follows my car with that rotation damping a two, height damping a two, and click play, and drive my car around. Uh, the thing is, the it's not very exciting as a game at the moment because I'm just kind of driving my car. And we all know that the best kind of car game is a racing game. So I need to put in cars to race against. Of course, it would be best if we could race against real people or do network gaming. And I have seen students do that. But it is hard. Network stuff is hard in Unity multiplayer stuff. So uh, work that out for yourself if you like. I'm not going there right now. What we have instead, though, is under standard assets, uh, vehicles, car, prefabs, as well as the car that I'm currently using, there's a, a waypoint car. And I'm just going to show you how to use that. So this is a, a waypoint car which is exactly the same car, it's got the same stuff attached to it, but it's got this extra script, which is the car AI control, which will make it drive through a set of waypoints. Um, and I just need to show you how to make the set of waypoints. So the, the waypoints are going to be in this circuit here, this waypoint circuit, we need to make it. So firstly, over here, create an empty object. Um, I'm going to rename it to my waypoint circuit and then within my waypoint circuit I'm going to create some more objects. Uh, I'm just going to leave it called game object for the moment um, and you'll see why in a little bit. So these are going to be some waypoints so here's one of them. Uh, I think I need to zoom out and do some positioning here. So that one there is going to go over there and then I'm going to control C control V and the one I've just copied oh my gosh I'm doing very well here am I simply moving things around I'm just going to move that one over to there control C control V so I'm getting lots of points that one's going over there it seems and control C control V so I'm just making myself a little circuit and it's going to go from point to point so I've got one, two, three, four, five individual waypoints. My very small circuit was probably too small. I don't think the car does very well with a circuit that small. But anyway, so now my waypoint circuit back up to here, I'm going to add, it's, at the moment it's just an empty object that's got some, uh, it's, it's not even doing anything. Uh, it's just a container really for these waypoints, which are the place that the circuit's going to go to. So I'm going to add a component to it. If I start searching on waypoint circuit, um, there's a waypoint circuit script and it's got a button that says assign using all child objects, which I'm going to do. And I'm also going to make it auto rename numerically from this order. So that's why I didn't bother renaming them earlier because I knew I was going to do that now. And you can see I've made myself a little circuit right there. So the last thing I need to do is go back to my waypoint based car scroll down to the bit where it needs uh, a circuit which it says none waypoint circuit my waypoint circuit drag that in there i have a feeling that might actually work let's hit play let's watch the non-red car see if it goes off around that circuit we'll follow him around shall we race him as it were there we go it looks like he's following some kind of a circuit at the moment let's throw some other cars into the mix as well so i've got my uh, car waypoint based, control C, control V, control V, control V. And of course, what I really want over here is some extra things to make it into a racetrack, but you can do that yourself in your own time. So hopefully, I'm going to have a race against this whole bunch of other cars. Let's go! Oh, yeah. Oh, some horrible accidents already. It's gone a bit chaotic. Um, but they all are going to carry on around that circuit. Now, of course, what we also want to do is want a lap counter and all the rest of it. And I do have another video on that if you go hunting through um, my my channel. So that might be the next thing to look at. See if you can work that out for yourself. Good luck.